Shalom, first and foremost, I'd like to give all praise and glory and honor to, to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Shalom to the elders and the deacons and the bishops and the Akim, and the brother, brothers that scattered through the four corners of the globe, the twelve tribes of uh, Israel, I say Shalom to you brothers out there for preaching this word truthfully and sincerely in the name of Yahweh and his only begotten son as well too mostly, mostly the heavenly father and his only begotten son and um, this is a news article from uh, online news editor uh uh, it's like a Latina media outlet. And this was posted uh, December the 21st, 2022. It's my first time seeing this uh, news article. And it reads for in the news of December 21st, 2022. And it reads uh, Seoul, Washington to hold realistically. Uh, military drills in 2023. Seoul of December 21st of 2022. And it reads, South Korea and the United States will expand scale and various vary of their military exercise and seek to recreate more realistic uh, situations during the first half of 2023 in the face of advancing North Korean missile programs, the Defense Ministry in a so said Wednesday and the first six months of the next year, the Allies will carry out 20 exercises, including annual drills such as the So Se-yong said the ministry following a meeting of top military commanders, Chair Defense Minister Yi Jong Su. The plan suggested that the Allies may once again hold the full Eagle exercise, which were suspended in 2019, amended talks of the CERN dis uh, disarmament with the North Korean regime. We decide to expand the scale and the types of combat field drills and connections with the combined exercise for the first half of next year, the ministry said in a statement after the meeting. The exercise will also seek to develop realistic training scenarios in light of advancing North Korean nuclear and missile threats, they said. The meeting also discussed a plan to install a new Joint Chief of Staff Division in charge of responding to threats from North Korea's nuclear weapons of mass destruction next month. The meeting also discussed the plans to promote greater use of artificial intelligence in the uh, army in declining birth rate in South Korea and further shortage of troops. North Korea has conducted a record number of missile tests this year, especially in the second half of the year, while South Korea and the United States have, have resumed their uh, major military maneuvers, the EFE. -F -E. And this is the book of um, This is the book of Mark chapter 13 verse 7 And when ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars Be ye not troubled for such things must need be But the end shall not be yet 
Right, because we're seeing a uh, rise and increase of uh, wars and rumors of wars of the nations and different kingdoms going against one another. That's why you're seeing this uh, military buildup, these uh, military training, these uh, military exercise, uh, realistically training drills, these uh, military exercise training of simulation type attack drills on their enemies and adversaries with the Iran Israel situation, the North Korea versus South Korea, the Israel, I mean, uh, Russia and Ukraine situation, and the uh, going on in the South China Sea as well, too, tensions with that as well, too. So we are seeing these uh, wars and rumors of wars are heating up. It had been increasing throughout the whole year of 2021 and 2022. And now, with a couple of weeks away, we're entering 2023. As we see, this news article uh, shows up of uh, what the tension between the United States versus South Korea, then North Korea versus uh, South Korea, what the tensions are heating up. Because you got the United States, Japan, and South Korea are increasingly uh, military partners. All three are military partners uh, against the rise and increase of uh, tensions with North Korea, and they look at that. They look at that as a uh, continual, imminent danger of what North Korea is doing. Well, they are developing uh, nuclear missiles, testing missiles, hypersonic missiles, ICBM missile launch tests as well too, can reach close to the United States territories of Guam, uh, Japan, and South Korea as well too. So that's why I brought out the scripture of uh, rumors of wars and nations against nations and kingdom against kingdoms as well too. And so with that, you know, I just want to bring out this uh, lesson of another increase of uh, wars and women's wars are heating up as we're entering, uh, getting close to entering uh, 2023 of uh, these women's wars are going to heat up now so more than ever. And so with that, I would like to give all praises and glory and honor too to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son as well too. Peace and blessings and respect to the elders and the deacons and the bishops and the Akim and the Akim that scattered of the twelve corners of I mean of the four corners of the earth preaching this word truthfully and sincerely. And until next time, I will say Shalom and all praises and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son as well too. And I'll say Shalom.